Hi guys, my name's Mitz and I'm going to show you how to change your WordPress password. Um, so in this case, um, just say you've set up a new WordPress website and you've forgotten your email uh, because usually you can put your email in and say, hey, I've forgotten my password. Um, so in this case, because um, I've got like 20,000 email addresses, so if you forget which email you've used, um, you can come into your server where your WordPress is installed and you can change the password. So what I'm going to do, I'm in my hosting now and I'm going to go scroll down the page and I'm looking for PHP admin and I'm going to go in there. Now um, just say I've got two lots of WordPress installed on here so it means that I'm going to have a few databases so we can see the databases over in the side here or we can go here we just press on databases now we've got um, now I know which database is which here so what I'm going to do is just press on it now it comes up with the, all the tables here now what we want to do is go to WP under dash users and press on it and in here we are going to press on edit. Now we can see that this is the password here and it's been encrypted. Okay, and it shows the um, email address and everything, which is not a true email address by the way. But anyway, it doesn't matter. Uh, let's press edit. Okay, so the username is Mitz and we'll need that to log in okay so we're going to use that um, now this here is encrypted so what I'm going to do is create a new password so I'm going to go and I'm going to go and search um, you can go to Google or whatever now um, it's MD5 I think it is encryption or MD5 generator there we go let's go we'll search for that in Google and um, there's one and it's called this one MD5 hash generator dot com let's go there I'm gonna put the password in so let's create a new password so let's just say KK R, R and 222 okay so let's make sure you remember that because you're going to ha actually have to um, use that to log in so what I'm going to do is open up a notepad just quickly I'm going to copy this and I'm going to paste it into that notepad that I've lost now here it is just in case okay because um, I'm really bad at remembering passwords. So what I'm going to do now is press generate MD5 hash and it comes up with this weird looking code and you copy it, okay? Now go back into your thing here. This is your database and it's in the user table. So what we're going to do is paste it in here. Okay, so forget about the old one. We've got a new one in there now. So what that code is going to do is it interprets into that new, new password that I've just used. Okay, um, come down the bottom here and I'm just going to press um, go. Okay, so let's have a look. Now when we look at this here, remember when I pressed edit? Well, it has the new code in here okay so that means that my password has changed to log in so let's go and log in now I'm gonna to have to open up another tab so I'm gonna to go to let's build websites but it's in a separate section members 
Okay, so we're in here and what I want to do is do wp-admin to log in to the WordPress dashboard. And now remember the um, username was Mitz and the password was this thing that I just made up. Okay, so let's see. Password, paste, login. Okay, here we go. It's letting me in. There we go, I'm in. Okay, so you saw me change the password. Now the funny thing is that I'll forget this password. Um, I'll definitely have to go back and change it. So yeah. Anyway, that's how easy it is. Um, once I'm in, I can go and change the password here too. Just go to users, go to my username and change the password back to something that I might remember. All right. Um, thanks for watching.